So last week we talked about a righteousness greater than the scribes and Pharisees with anger, lust, divorce, oaths, revenge, and love. Now, Matthew goes on to warn against a wrong kind of righteousness where people are not trying to conform to the will of God or imitate his perfection, but rather to look good in front of other people. So these hypocrites and Gentiles, they did these things in public just so people think that they're righteous. They think he's a righteous dude. Jesus points out three kinds of righteous acts that were done in public. First, large donations to the temple were often announced publicly. Second, prayers were always said out loud and usually in front of others. Today, many people pray silently, you know, where you can't tell if the person in front of you at church is deep in prayer or asleep. Well, the ancients didn't really do that. See, they always prayed out loud, so it's easy for people to think, wow, that guy, he's a good prayer. And third, apparently hypocrites fasted and it made themselves look so miserable that it was seen as pious. So Jesus tells us that we should do all three of these things in secret. The point is not that you can't give or pray or fast. Jesus even says when you do these things, implying that his disciples do them, but rather, what is your motivation? See, verse three talks about being applauded and the Greek word here is doxadzo, and it's the same word used in Matthew 5, 16 for when people give glory to God. So this means that your heart is in the wrong place when you do these righteous things. You are seeking for people to give you this doxadzo, this glory or applause, rather than giving it to God. So basically, you're robbing God the glory. And this is what the hypocrites and Gentiles want. They want the glory. They want the applause. And so Jesus says that they have received their reward in full. Jesus instead calls his disciples, us, to give the glory to God. So there you go. A little bit about righteousness. And that's enough today for our historical minute.